So I'm having a night off. How nice is that? Jason is in the kitchen, singing his head off, cooking our dinner. We're having chilli con carne. So that would be nice. So I haven't got a cook. So I thought I'd do a little little video while he's in there um, doing his, um, his cooking. And um, I thought I'd have a little chat with you. So, um, yeah, don't know what I'm going to chat about. <laughs> I got my gin and tonic. So, um, it's Friday night. It's half past six. I've started a little bit early. <laughs> what the hell? It's been a hard week. It's been a long week. Even though it's because it's a bank holiday. It's like, if you have a bank holiday, you think, oh, four days, that'll go really quickly. But it actually, you've got to cram five days work into those four days. So you end up knackered by Friday. <laughs> so we've just walked the dog. So we took Kimbo for a walk. Um, took her around the block. So that was nice. That was pretty uneventful. Nothing happened. And um, yeah, we're back home now. And Josie's cooking um, cooking dinner. And I've got glare on my glasses. I can see it, look. From the windows. <laughs> that there's my... Um, I crocheted this. I do a bit, I used to do a lot of crochet, I don't do so much these days, but um, yeah, I can't knit, but I can crochet, so um, I think I don't do so much these days because um, I've got loads of like throws, and what else can you do, it's a bit difficult isn't it with crochet, I don't really like crochet clothes, so um, yeah, I've done hats and I've done scarves and things, I've got a couple of hats, um, yeah, so I might I might do some more. But yeah. But I taught myself, well, YouTube taught me how to uh, crochet and it wasn't till about six months later I realised I'd I had um, taught myself the American stitches, not the English. <laughs> so when they say you do a um you crochet a double a double stitch, I was doing like a single for an ink for America, a monk English would have been a single, but I was doing the double for the American. So now, if I look at some, if I watch someone on YouTube, um, it's English. I have to think about it and convert it to <laughs> English stitches. So yeah, so that was a bit, a bit rubbish really. But to be honest, most of the people that I watch on YouTube are American. Uh, they're really an, um Australians. They're really into um crochet much more than um, the UK so it, it doesn't really worry it doesn't matter but yeah so that's my that's my little crochet um I was going to show you this this is my has anyone else got this it's such a good book I had this given to me free um I don't actually go to Slim and World uh, classes anymore I, I it wasn't for me I don't like all the clapping and the um, you lost two pound this week. What did you do? Well done, sort of business. So it's not really for me. So um, I did go for about six six months, maybe six months, and I got myself sort of into the swing of it and to sort of learn how you know how to do it, so to speak. And I got some of the books and everything, and then I sort of went alone with it, doing it. But then we had Christmas. <laughs> Yeah, and um, it all sort of fell by the, you know, yeah, it did. But we, unfortunately, really sadly, we lost our dog, um, which was really so, so sad. It was um, Rufus, he was called, bless him. And um, he was a cavalier, King Charles Cavalier. I don't know if you can see him. He's there, up on the wall. There's Rufus. And then there's another picture on the other side, and that's Rufus and Kimmy together um, at the beach. And, um, yeah, we took him for a walk. Didn't think there's nothing wrong with him. And um, sadly he died. And um, we ended up not really knowing what to do. It was Sunday afternoon. Um, I rang my mum, and we ended up going to my mum's. And we buried him in her garden. And... Um, came home without him <laughs> so hmm, really sad um, sorry <laughs> Did, 
Blimey, what am I like? Sorry about that. <laughs> I didn't expect to do that. Um, yeah, it's it's obviously it's it's only been five months since we lost Rufy, and um, he was such a big character and such a, a big part of our lives. You know, it's still quite you know raw. It um it hurts. You know, it does hurt. Um, we miss him dreadfully. We really do. Kimmy misses him too. You know. Not just us, but anyway, so that's why I started doing YouTube because um, Rufus was a bit of a lap dog and he used to love to sit on my lap and um, in the evenings and um, I couldn't really do a lot because he was a big fat lump sat on my lap and um, I don't know how I got into the YouTube actually, I just... I was watching some YouTubes and uh, some other YouTubers and I thought, you know, I reckon I could do this. Um, fumble my way through, you know, and um, make it light-hearted. And I didn't want to be serious. I didn't want to be too serious. I just want to, you know, take me as you find me sort of thing, you know. And um, so I had a go and my husband said, you're a natural. You're really good at it. You know, you are good at it. Um, but it has become a bit obsessive. <laughs> it's taken over my life a little bit. Um, I sort of think about it and think and think about recipes that I can do, and I I video most nights. Um, Jason's got to the point where he sort of does it <clears throat> at the door, so I know he's coming in, <laughs> and I press pause for him, bless him. Um, but yeah, I have enjoyed it, and it has helped me get back on track. Um, I'm also um, do Instagram and um, normally my pictures of my food um, go up before my videos because we've got quite slow blooming internet and um, it takes ages to download my videos. I mean the one I did last night took an hour and a half, it was a right pain in the butt. So um, if you follow me on Instagram you'll see what I've done before my video's gone on. Um, if you don't, then my name's my name is my Instagram name, which is Pauline Date. Um, so yeah, check me out. <laughs> and um, yeah, so that's how I got into it really from Rufus, bless him. <laughs> um, yeah, and I do enjoy it. I I enjoy cooking. You know, I do enjoy cooking. I don't enjoy all the washing up, even with a dishwasher. I still don't enjoy that, <laughs> but. Um, yeah, I do enjoy it and I enjoy all the comments. I love the comments, so yeah, keep giving me the comments, it's lovely. But I've now got 65 subscribers, which I'm really pleased about. And thank you to all of you that have subscribed. Um, I'm really, you know, really chuffed to bits. Um, and hopefully, I'll get more. So, you know, um, I see all these people and they've got like thousands of subscribers, and I think, oh my god, how do they get all those? You know, um, I don't know, I suppose it just takes time, I don't know. But yeah, so I'm hoping to get 100 soon, that would be nice. Um, I've been doing it a couple of months now, so, um, you know, maybe in six weeks' time, maybe I'll have 100 subscribers. How cool would that be? That would be so cool. Anyway, I can hear Jace, it sounds like my tea's nearly ready, so um, I just thought I'd do just a little, a little video, just about... Why I'm a YouTuber, I suppose, and um, yeah, a little bit about about our Rufy. <laughs> anyway, have a good Friday. I'm gonna have another gin tea in a minute, and I'm gonna look forward to my um, chili con carne that my husband's cooking for me. Slim, well friendly, of course. And I'll catch you soon. All right, take care. Bye.